this is a <clears throat> electrolysis test of potassium hydroxide, otherwise known as caustic potash. Want to note before I get started that this particular sample has been in the jar for several days and uh, I keep getting a little bit of particulate here. Now I only used, oh what was it? Quarter teaspoon per gallon. So I'm thinking that the, uh, I'm thinking that the uh, particular source is not technical grade potassium hydroxide. The only way I'll know is to get another sample and see what I get. So here goes the test. Got 76 degrees in the water. Looks like about two amps in the water or on the ammeter. I'm showing uh, what appears to be moderate production. And check back in in about 15 minutes. At 25 minutes, I've got 94 degrees in the water. About 2 amps on the ammeter. Um, I've got some brown particulate beginning to form and there's a white foam on the surface. At 51 minutes I got 113 degrees in the water. Looks like about 2 amps on the ammeter. The brown particulate is growing, although kind of slowly. Um, the foam on top has started to look like old dishwater washing suds and there's uh, brown particulate mixed in with it. I wouldn't call it I wouldn't call it scum just there's brown particulate in the foam. At one hour I've got 120 degrees in the water, two amps on the ammeter, uh, brown particulate is still steadily increasing and still got white foam on the surface uh, if I look at the particulate that was already on the bottom I've got oh something like about three sixteenths of an inch at an hour and fifteen minutes I have 129 degrees in the water looks like about three amps on the ammeter the uh, particulate is still progressing in quantity. Um, I still have I still have foam on the surface. It looks like bubble production is quite good. At an hour and 25 minutes, I got 136 degrees in water. Brown particulate is uh, increasing, although not at a very high rate. I still have white foam on the surface and it's like about three amps on the ammeter. At an hour and 35 minutes, we've got 142 degrees in the water. Uh, the particulate is beginning to get a little bit chunky. Although it's not really growing all that fast. I've got uh, maybe five amps on the ammeter and of course there's foam on the surface gas production looks pretty good at an hour and 45 minutes I've got 148 degrees in water looks to be right at five amps on the ammeter I've got uh, Looks like about a quarter of an inch of particulate on the bottom plus what's floating in the water. Um, there's foam on the surface with a little bit of brown particulate in it. It doesn't look or act like 
uh, scum. It just looks like old, you know, looks like dish soap that's been sitting for a little while. I want to ignite the foam to get it off so you can get an idea how much uh, production there is. Now the <laughs> the sound that's recorded has nothing to do with the sound. This sounds like a rifle going off next to your head. That's why you should wear ear protection if you're going to do this sort of thing. And there's the production. Not too bad for just two little plates. This is uh, almost as good as salt. This is uh, the after test of observations for potassium hydroxide. And there's a little bit of a patina on that side and on that side. Don't see any evidence of corrosion.